Hello. For those of you who are interested in how to make your own CNC, my name is Wesley. I am presently making a series of videos to help you with this. To let you know what's involved, what controllers are, what servos are, what you need, ball screws, monitors, piece of machinery. This machine was once a new 14 by 40 lathe, just a straight engine lathe. Today, she's a fully converted CNC using mock motion controls and Mach 3 software. Something I believe that anybody can do. Having built several CNC's, I was asked to share my experiences with everyone. I'd like to talk to you about what variable frequency drives are, they allow you to spindle controls, how to convert a single phase to use a three phase mortar. What are they talking about with breakout boards? What does a breakout board do? Why you need a control panel and what's involved in the control panel? Drivers. There's variable types of drivers. And we'll discuss these in further detail. You have to strip down your machine and insert ball screws in place of the Acme screws. This is a step by step that I'm going to be doing with everyone. Once you've got your ball screws in, or once they're ordered in, in you have uh, many different suppliers that can supply you a ball screw and a nut. They've got to be machined and brought into perspective so that they'll fit right back where the other lead screw was. This isn't a task that is beyond anyone. The boards will explain. We'll explain what monitors you need, what controllers you need, what computers you need. Now if this is something you think you would enjoy, I'm making the step-by-step -step videos and you can contact me and ask me your questions that are bothering you about going ahead with it yourself. You can take an old lathe and turn it into a CNC or a newer lathe and turn it into a CNC. Either way you can achieve it. You could use a mill. This was a brand new mill. Now it's a full four axis CNC. If you feel you can benefit from this feel free to contact me. Let me know what you want, what you'd like to have. I'd be more than pleased to help you. Thank you.